people and I'm back cooking again and today I'm going to make chips no wait chips with cheese now as you can't you can't see the oh, the fat is bubbling yet yeah, because it's only more or less just been turned on but I'm going to put the chips in so they can start doing nothing doesn't matter. I feel it getting a bit warmer now when I'm putting the chips in. As some of you will know, my son can't have che <coughs> che cheese. <coughs> so I won't be putting cheese on his, but I'll be putting cheese on mine. I think that should be enough for you, eh? There we are. Now I don't know how long the chips take. The only reason I know when the chips are done is because they, they go golden brown. A nice golden brown, which you can tell when they're done. Uh, if you want to make it into a chip butter, which I will be doing, you can do, you can either have bread or bread, bread, bread cakes, it's your choice. This is my son's end product, as you know he can't have cheese, but mine will have plenty of cheese on. I'm not ashamed to say I do like cheese. My, lip, my poor little taste tester is going to try his chips. It's been made into a chip butter. Just tell me, does it taste like chips? <laughs> yeah. It does? Yeah. Oh my word. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> So do I get a thumbs up? <laughs> Thank you! As you probably can see my chips are like a slightly golden brown. This is a work of art. That's my chips and here goes my cheese. As you can see, there's a lot of cheese, but I love cheese. Just because Lee can't have it doesn't mean I can't have it. Right, this is the end product of chips and cheese. I don't know why I forgot of chips and cheese. I hope I give you a rough idea of how to do chips. Cheese on chips. If you want to do it different, like a, bit of, a few chips and cheese, then a few more chips and cheese. It's your choice how you want to do it. Uh, if you like what you've seen, please keep viewing me. And if you want to leave me, a, give me a big old thumbs up. It would be much appreciated. And if you want to leave me a comment, uh, the more the merrier. And if you haven't already subscribed to me, or you know someone who hasn't subscribed to me, tell them to get subscribing. Thank you. Bye. Just to let you know, I've just been told uh, by my son that it's my 99th video. Now, I always said for my 100th video, I was going to do a Q&A. If you don't know what Q&A is, it's questions and I answer them. Uh, if you want to leave a few questions, or, well, I prefer you would do, but if you want to leave a few questions, I will answer them on a Q&A, and I am thinking of doing it on Friday, which will give you plenty of time to get all your questions in, and I will answer as many as I can, probably try and get them all mentioned, but I'm not promising nothing. Thank you.